Okay, good morning YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to show you my small G stash. I did get my delivery off Kijiji as well as um, some that I bought at a local consignment store. So I would like to go over um, how much things cost new, how much I got them for, uh, cost of making your own uh, G cloth as opposed to buying inserts or purchasing G cloth, and um, show you my stash. Okay, so first I just want to show you my stash. Uh, I've got nine small G diapers. They're the little G pants. Um, they all, I also received um, extra, eight extra in snapper-in liners um, to go with them. So they are all already have liners in them, plus the eight extra. Um, and in total, these cost me $68.43. Um, but new, um, if you went and got uh, new on G diapers, these can cost anywhere from $19 to $24 each. Um, you can also buy a two-pack of um, the planar colors at London Drugs, and that'll cost you two of them for uh, $34.99, but they do go on sale for $29.99, so just keep your eyes open if you want to go new. They do go on sale. And then the extra pouches you can only buy on G Diapers or um, eBay or places like that. And those will run you six extra pouches for $24 and mine were all included. I was a bit concerned about a couple of these that I got used and I heard they can only last about six months. You see this one um, doesn't have a whole lot of stretch left in it, whereas this is really quite stretchy. So I'm thinking a couple, there was only about three that looked like that, um, so I still will have lots extra, um, but that's one concern that I did have. Um, people have also said that the ends um, will fray. I didn't have any um, fraying tips. For my G diapers, some of them had some pilling on them. I've already washed and um, prepped all these, um, but they, I just went across it with a razor blade, um, like for shaving your legs, a big razor and um, cleaned up all of the pilling and made them like new again. I went through the Velcro with a pin and they all look fantastic. The lady that I got them from did say she only used them for about three months. Great, and now for the inserts. Um, so I've showed you already um, in a previous video how I made my cloth um, inserts. Um, but I didn't really tell you how much they cost me. So uh, with the bamboo and the hemp, and the cost of the thread and the tools, if you already had those, you it would only cost you uh, $73.27 for all of them, coming out to just over $2 a piece. Um, on the G Diaper website, um, G Cloth run six of them for $37. Uh, and then you can get the um, refills, the biodegradable refills. I did buy one pack, mostly to see what they felt like and what they seemed like. I'm might use them a bit at the beginning if they fit um, for when I have the meconium or if they have any really bad um, diarrheal problems or if the cloth just isn't working out for some reason. Um, I've got a backup. And these uh, you can get on uh, G Diaper for $16.99 um, for one. If you go to London Drugs they are $19.99 for a pack but they go on sale for $16.99 um, quite regularly. I'd say once or twice a month. And there is my stash of small G diapers. It's a rather large stash, I know. Um, not necessarily needing that many. This cost me $130. And if bought new, would be closer to $500. That's including taxes. Of course, I didn't have to pay taxes. I did have to pay a bit of shipping fees um, that you wouldn't necessarily have to do if you bought it new. But I think they're all in great condition, and I am so excited for when I get to put my little one in these. Thanks, YouTube. Please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. I will have more videos coming out shortly on probably more do-it-yourself projects for the next little while, now that I have my stash.